Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be showing you the sticker books that I keep right on my desk and using the Happy Planner uh, Little Bloom Box storage box. So this was a video that was requested by Chantelle of My Fabulous Plans on Instagram. And these are the sticker books that I keep right on the side of my desk. They're always next to me because I reach for them the most and um, use them in, I use at least, you know, one of them in every spread that I'm doing, uh, or mo most of the spreads that I'm doing. So they're really in no order, but I thought I would just show you my top favorites. I do have room, I think, in here for, for one more, so there is room. But in addition to these, I also keep on the side of my desk these two of a plan sticker books which I don't think are available anymore but Friday August 7th which probably is passed by the time this video goes live um Heather's third sticker book which are colorful words and I think they're a lot of these same words but they're in different colors will be available so if you haven't already purchased it definitely do because once these are gone they're gone and they are my favorites okay so let's start with my number one, Colorful Boxes. This is the original Colorful Boxes sticker book. I have several of them. Uh, I don't know how badly used this one is. The silver and gold are good, but black, I don't think I have any black left in this one I do. Definitely, I don't have any of these left. Um, there's still some colors. But if you don't have this original Colorful Boxes sticker book, I highly recommend it. It's usually available on Amazon for like $11, so it's a nice low price. Um, and I think I'll put a link in my bio to where you can find all of these, whether it's on Amazon or on thehappyplanner.com. Colorful Boxes, highly recommend. <laughs> Next up is the new Functional from the little balloon box because it's perfectly functional for all of my planning needs. And then I have appointments. This is one that I haven't used yet, but I wanna to remember to use. So um, I have it here because these boxes are really great. I'll probably be cutting a bunch of them up or like whiting out part of the middle because I won't have a ton of appointments coming up. So like here's one where you could really just white this out and the colors are great to make them work for you but I wanna to remember to use it, so I'm keeping it front and center. Okay, next up is, well, these are kind of two of the same. These are essential planning. They're almost the same. This one has 1,009 pieces, this one has 716. And this one is 20 pages. So it's a little bit smaller, but it's a great sticker book for new planners if you're just getting into it because it really has everything holidays birthdays work schedule bill pay travel food meal planning shopping list chores and there's a reason it's the essential planning sticker book and i have two of these this is the older one you can tell it's older because i wrote the uh, name here at the top newer sticker books like this one, have the names already printed, which was a wonderful addition by the Happy Planner. Okay, and as you'll see on a lot of mine also, I tie this part up here, and that's so that sometimes with older books, as the pages, as you turn to flip the pages a lot, they lose that like gummy part here. And so this way they don't fall out. And it also used to be so that I could tell by the color what sticker book it was at a glance. Right, next up is Teresa Collins, The Happy Planner from that Be Happy box. I guess that was last year. And this is another really great functional sticker book and it has a lot of neutrals in it. So this is one I reach for all the time. And then of course, budget. Uh, this is the newer budget sticker book and I need it every week. Next up is Super Mom. This was, this is two years old, I think. And if you're able to still find one and you don't have one, it's really functional. We've got all of these words, icons, a lot of icons, some decorative stuff, um, and a lot of these circles, which you can tell <laughs> I've used. So 
this is a must-have sticker book for me. And then we have another functional. Um, I purchased an additional functional sticker book online from the Little Bloom Box. And then also from the Little Bloom Box is florals because of course, once I can get myself to use them because they're so pretty and they aren't restocking this book that I know of. The next one that I prefer to keep right front and center is journaling. Looks like I have some silver stickers there. Um, but journaling is really useful. There's dates, boxes, icons, tracking. I've used a lot of these, not a ton of the gold ones in here because I don't usually love putting the foiled stuff in my planner, but this is a really useful sticker book. And then watercolor. This one, I had the original, ver well, I think this is the same as the original. It's a much older sticker book. Um, I don't know what year it is, but it's much older. And while I don't love a ton of these watercolors anymore, some of them may work, but there are a lot of great quotes in here. And there's some washi strips. There's also these great boxes, icons, more of these great black quotes, which are my favorite flight information, colorful boxes, bullets. So this is a really good basic sticker book also. Now, fun alphabets, because I love being able to play with the colors in here and add them into my planner and put words in when I need to, or at the top of some of the pages I make. And then I have two of these colorful shape sticker books in here um, because similar to function or colorful boxes, just like being able to have them and utilize them in my planner. So I have two of these. Then handwritten plans, which is newer. I think it just came in the summer release. And these are all just words. These are on um, paper. So they're, they're paper stickers. They're not see-through or they're not clear. And this is a great sticker book. I think I've said great a lot of times. Maybe I'll go do a giveaway. Let me know how many times I said great in this video. And I'll find a sticker book to send you. Household. Uh, not only, I originally bought this more for the colors than for it actually being household because each of these pages here is a different color scheme. But I'm finding that these icons similar to Supermom are really helpful for my daily planning. And then journaling doodles, which came hand in hand with journaling. So most of them are black and white stickers or gold. And see, and I for, like I forgot that these bucket list stickers were in here. I think there must have been a summer. Yep, there was a summer that I missed. It would have been great to include these in my summer bucket list, but I can remember to put it in fall. These florals. This is a fun sticker book. Okay. Now, colorful boxes three. This is the third, third colorful boxes. And these are almost more like paint, paint swatch or paint splash. I don't think I'm saying that right. Colorful boxes in a couple of different color schemes. There's some florals in here too. And then finally, my rainbow mega book. This is probably my favorite mega book. It's the one I use the most. And there's a bunch of pages in every color of the rainbow that you can imagine. Well, I guess you don't really imagine what colors are in the rainbow, but there's a lot. Um, and it's really great for pulling together any color scheme or of course doing a rainbow spread. So I think right now I do have room for one more sticker book in here. So let me know in the comments what sticker book you think I'm missing from my must have near me at all times sticker books. And thank you so much for watching. I would love if you took a moment to like this video and subscribe. And again, I have links to um, most of these probably in the description and I'll see you next time.